Hello guys, welcome back to another video today. I'm gonna be going over the new Roblox Islands update in this video. And this update is kind of small, just to let you guys know, it's only pretty much shared account and a lot of school props. But we're gonna be going over everything in this video, and if you wanna go get my merch, it's gonna be the first link in the description. This is limited time, only for six Robux, and now let's get straight on to this video. Alrighty, so firstly, we're going to start off with the new furniture and new decor. We're gonna go ahead and go over here and place my furniture workbench and I'm gonna show you where to craft this. So if we go ahead and open the furniture workbench, all you're going to have to do is scroll all the way down to the bottom. You will see all the new items here. So there's a wet floor sign, there is a school water fountain, there's a lunch table, there are lunch benches, there's a red locker, uh, lockers, and then there is school chairs, there is desk and chair, and then there is a school desk, a school bell, and then they have a blackboard and a whiteboard where you can craft. So, you can craft all of these in different colours, and I'll show you that in a second. But these are all the items you can craft in this update, which is pretty cool. So, the first item I'm going to be going over is the water fountain. So, you place this on wall, so you just got to build a block, and then you can easily place it, as you can see. Then we have the slippery floor sign, what is here, which just sits down, like you don't really need anything for it, like you can just place it. And then we have over here the red school bell what can come in white as well so red or white you can craft that in any of those colors then we have the whiteboard which just has a couple of shapes here then it has like these whiteboard markers which is pretty good and then we have the blackboard what has the chalk and the eraser to actually draw on the blackboard you cannot interact with it but it is what it is then we have the I forgot what this one was called it's just called the red lunch table what can be crafted in red, blue, yellow, green, or purple, any of those colors, what is very cool. Then we have this red lunch bench, so not a table, this is just a bench, what can be crafted in red, blue, yellow, green, or purple. Then we have the lockers, what can actually store items in there, and the these lockers can store all the way up to, to 180 items, what is not too bad, but it's still not the best. But you can craft that in red, blue, yellow, green, or purple. Then we have the chair, we can craft in red, blue, yellow, green, or purple. Then we have the chair with the table, what can be crafted in red, blue, yellow, green, and purple. So all of those can be crafted with red, blue, yellow, green, and purple. What is pretty cool. And that is it for all of the furniture. None of these can be crafted in different variances, or these two cannot be crafted in different colors. So, so that's pretty much it for all of the new items. So before we get on to the shared accounts part, I'm going to show you some other bugs they have fixed. So apparently there was these issues with colored slabs um, not rendering correctly, so they have fixed that bug there. The potato prices have risen from 11 to 17, and cactus prices have dropped from 30 to 25. And Pharmacletus was recently heard whispering about carrot prices, so they will probably go up next week. By the way, next week is going to be a small update as well and then on the 17th going to be a big update hint it's gonna be something with snow what is going to be pretty cool so let's go ahead and show you what the shared account is so what you're going to have to do is click the shop then go to unlocks scroll all the way down to the bottom and you should see shared bank account access your shared bank account share coins between your profiles so this was 119 robux what's so one of the like cheapest game passes in islands it is one of the cheapest game passes in islands what is really good and it's a good price for shared bank so let me show you how to use the shared bank system so once you have bought that game pass if you have not bought that game pass yet you cannot do any of this what i'm about to show you what you're going to do is go to the hub and just head straight to the bank then when you're at the bank right here just talk to the banker rob and click view account then you should see you have personal account and shared account right here. I have 
18 million coins in here. So, we have 18 million coins here. So, we have just basically, so basically we have 18 million coins in here. The max is 1 billion for this since I have not upgraded any tiers or anything like that. These are different basically banks when you think about it. Like, the other bank has a tier of 8. This one only has a tier of 0 and I don't think I really need to upgrade it anymore since I'm probably going to be using my personal one more and only shared account to transfer stuff through profiles. But say, we have 18 million in here. Now we can go to my profiles, my save slots, and we can go to a random one. Let's just use my newest Christmas build for DV's build contest as an example. So when I travel to there, I can go to the hub, go to the bank, and I can get that money. Alrighty, so I have loaded into my slot, and I'm going to go straight to the hub, and then we're going to go straight to the bank. And I'll show you that this has transferred it over to this account. Alrighty, so we're in the hub, so once we get over to the bank, I can show you that this is actually going to work. So we're going to go ahead and talk to Rob right now, click view account, and we have the 18 million here. So what we got to do is click on it, then click withdraw, and we can just withdraw, say let's go 8 million coins, or yeah, there we go, we got 8 million coins extra on this account now. What is pretty good and now say I, I, I don't want this 8 million anymore I, I want to transfer it back over to my main account so I can just go here I can go and click deposit then we can just do 8 million coins and then we have only 200 million left on this account and um, my main account can actually collect that so this is pretty handy if you need coins to go from profile to profile what is really handy and just a reminder guys if you haven't if you've skipped through the video and you missed this that there is going to be a Chris Christmas update on the 16th of December. So keep an eye out on that. So it's not going to be next week's. Next week is going to be a light update as well. Then after that week is over, there will be the Christmas update. So you're going to be hyped for this one because I'm pretty sure it's going to be really big since the past couple of updates have been really small. And I'm really hyped for this update. So, okay, so that's going to be in the video, guys. So I hope you did enjoy this video. So if you did enjoy this video make sure to leave a like subscribe to the notification bell on if you like my content if you don't you don't have to subscribe but just go watch a couple more islands videos and i'm gonna see you in the next video or live stream youtube go buy my new merch it's only for six robux the top link in the description and now goodbye youtube